In this video we are going to talk about the biggest cryptocurrency exchange coin and this is a Binance coin. So welcome guys if you are new to this channel consider subscribing if you are interested in different cryptocurrency project reviews and price predictions as this is one type of videos which I am doing here on Crypto Bull channel guys. Let's get into it let's not waste time and let's talk about binance coin so what is binance coin so binance coin is the native coin of binance cryptocurrency exchange if you are new guys to cryptocurrency space then binance is the biggest cryptocurrency exchange out there which means that this is the most liquid cryptocurrency exchange if you are from europe you can use that binance.com but if you are from united states you can use binance.us this cryptocurrency exchange has been created back in 2017 and it straight away got a huge popularity so now it is the most liquid cryptocurrency exchange now we know that this is the biggest cryptocurrency exchange let's talk about this coin and let's have a look at token economics of binance coin at the very beginning in 2017 when binance coin was created it was also created on ethereum blockchain technology which means that at the very beginning binance coin was a erc20 token this was not a coin at the time however after they have changed it and they have created their own blockchain and now it is not token anymore it is their own native coin if you come here in coin market cap you will see in second row that it states here that this is a coin and this is exactly because the reason guys that they have created their own blockchain and they have also their explorer if you come here and you can check it there guys and you can see every single transactions and everything what is happening on this binance blockchain let's have a look at value of binance coin currently circulations there are for 154 million maximum supply of binance coins there will be only 170 million however you should know guys that at the very beginning there was 200 million binance coins released and currently you might ask why there is only 170 million left and this is because of reasons that Binance is buying back their coins every quarter of the year they are buying back 20% from their profits of Binance from trading they are buying back these coins and they are burning them which means that they are destroying these coins and at the end there will be left only maximum supply or even in circulation circulating supply only 100 million coins because they are going to burn half or 50% of their coins so this means means that only 100 million coins will be left this means guys that this is deflationary cryptocurrency which every quarter is being burned and if you are interested more in how Binance is burning as you can see here here is BNB burn they, they are stating here on their site if you are interested I will leave this link in first comment and in description come in and you can read more about these Binance burns and they are reporting this every quarter as you can see last 13th burn was 2,253,000,000 coins they burned and at the time when they were doing this burn the coins price was $30 per one Binance coin guys so this is also very important to understand because when you are buying Binance coin it is getting more and more valuable every quarter because every quarter Binance is buying back 20% of profits their own coin which is very important if you are interested to or if you are going to invest in Binance coin another thing is that you can also participate in Binance IEOs guys which means that on Binance there is launchpad where Binance is supporting a lot of different projects like uh, Matic for example was also supported by Binance and Injective protocol uh, the recent ones which we also reviewed on this channel that project also was supported by Binance and all these projects are getting IEOs for token sales when these projects are being launched here on Binance however there was a huge demand on these IEOs and lots of people wanted to get these coins first on these projects which are being released so Binance created a ticketing system or lottery system where you need to hold some particular amount of these Binance coins if you want to participate in these lotteries for example if you would want to get one lottery ticket as you can see here guys you would need to have 50 to 200 Binance coins and you would be able to participate and you would have a chance to participate 
participate in these IEOs for new projects which are being launched on Binance. So this means that you would have one lottery ticket or one chance to participate in these IEOs and get the coins first or get your hands on coins first. And as you know, guys, if you are getting hands first on the projects or coins, which are being released and lots of people are looking at it you can make straight away 10x or up to 100x on your investment for example you can buy a coin for one cent and at the release date it could go up to one dollar and you could sell it and you could make straight away 100x on your investment that's why many people want to get and participate in these new project releases and ieos and yes guys like i mentioned you for one lottery ticket to participate in these ieos you need 50 to 200 coins for two lottery tickets it's 200 to 300 coins and for three lottery tickets it would be like 300 to 400 coins and for four tickets and so on and so forth as you can see here in this graph guys there are a lot of initiatives for people to buy these binance coins and another initiative for users to hold binance coins for example is that you can participate and you can vote for new projects which to be listed which you would like to be listed on Binance. For example, if there is a new project on Binance here, you can come in and you can find new projects which they are go asking for community. Would, would community want to release or would community want to list on Binance, guys? And those people who has the most coins, Binance coins, they have the most votes here on Binance. Another initiative for users to hold these Binance coins is for referrals because there you also, if you have the most coins, I believe if you have over 500 or something coins, you can get 40% from referrals which you are referring to Binance. There are many more initiatives here on Binance and they are all the time working on new features. At the very beginning when Binance was launched, there were no like... Uh, uh, futures trading that were not leverage trading and none of those all options are integrated here into Binance. So in general Binance coin has a lot of different uh, use cases which you can use for and that's why people have a lot of initiative to hold Binance coin. And now let's get to coin itself as, uh, as I already mentioned guys currently this coin costs $41. And where I think with this coin could go is that it could go easily to 200 $300. This altcoin season is most likely Binance coin will go up to $200. Many people will be trading on Binance and many people will want to participate in these new IEOs released on Binance and so on and so forth. So that's why I think that Binance coin could easily go up to $200 hundred dollars so as many people still don't know that Binance is burning their coins and every quarter there is less and less coins left in circulation because Binance are burning them so yes guys this is just my opinion on Binance and where it could go so two hundred dollars and if you found this video useful leave a like share this video and if you have your projects which you would like me to review on this channel leave them in comments of this video and see you in the next one